Oh, Facebook war. Let's see if I can invite some people. <laughs> I know some people at work, some people on a vacay. Some niggas ain't got no job at all right now. So I figured I'd try to go live, sneak one in right quick. Even if you at the job site, you know what I'm saying? You can still, <clears throat> you know, got the headphones, some earphones. Can listen to your boy. Oh, hold on a second, man. I just want to talk some little ish right quick, man. That's it. That's all there is ever to do on Facebook, ain't it? Yo. Hey. Yeah, man. Try to see if I can get a few more folks in. What up, though? Oh, man. It's been a lot going on, man. These past couple days, man. Other than the new year. It's been a lot going on, man. Especially within the past, like, what, 48 hours or something like that? Uh, gotta pay attention out here, man. It's about to be the first quarter of the, of the year. Ain't no telling what's about to pop off. I'm, I'm, I'm predicting right now it's probably going to be either some type of mass shooting predicting that shit right now. It's probably going to be some Hold on. Damn airplane. I'm predicting some type of mass shooting, man. Uh, probably going to be a church or a school. It's going to be, I mean, it's the same recycling thing. You understand what I'm saying? It's like every year, man. Hey! Leave that shit alone. Leave it alone. It's like every year, it's, it's the same thing, man. Same results, same type of vibe and energy being put out there. But in 2019, you got to keep that vibe going good. You understand what I'm saying? 2019, you got to keep this vibe. We got to keep this energy rolling. You know what I mean? You got, uh, you got these people, these bold, man. These people are bold out here, yo. What up? It's the meddling. These people are bold though, man. Yeah, you know I mean, I seen the uh, I seen the video clip of the, uh, I think it was in Florida, and we're just gonna say that you know we're gonna call them a uh, SWS because Facebook will shut me down. I get the same specific words, but white dude ran up on a uh, black chicken in a, in a fast food place, and he was in there talking crazy. And try to grab the, the, the girl. Try to grab the well he did grab her. Grabbed a black black girl, black female. And he like I don't know who knows what he was getting ready to do to her. But you know what though? <laughs> what was so what was so great was that when she when he grabbed her, man, she didn't even hesitate. She just started swinging on him, like swinging and swinging. And she had his shirt and he just kept bending down and he couldn't even he couldn't even do nothing, man. It was a, this was supposed to be a grown ass man, but you know what I mean. Like she was, she was trying to beat the brakes off this dude. First off, let me also say, man, I'm down here in San Antonio, Texas. Hey, hey, hey! Come here, come here. Damn dog. Let me show. Let me show what he did. Man, he a puppy, man. He here barking heavy like he. <clears throat> he barking like he gonna do something. Hey. Right. Hey. Right. He might do something though. <laughs> Stop all that barking. Hey, here's this other little dog, man, down the street. I don't know if these niggas trying to talk to each other or what. 
Ahí. Ahí. But yeah, man, it was crazy that, you know what I mean? She, uh, now, now, you know, supposedly, man, I think they fired her. They fired this chick, this chick, man. And that's the part that, you know what I mean, that, that, that I'm not surprised. You understand what I'm saying? I'm not surprised that they fired that, that, that chick, um, that, uh, beat the dude up in the, in the fast food spot. I'm not surprised, but I mean, it was dirty though. You know what I mean? They fired her, but see, this is the thing though. After they, after they got her away from him. They was getting ready to take his order and shit. Like, they was getting ready to give him some food. I was like, man, what the... F like, I'm telling you, man, this, this shit's getting crazy out here, man. This shit's getting crazy out here. And, you know, the only thing you really can do is just kind of prepare yourself for something like that, man. Because, you know, a lot of people act like, you know, they don't want to trip off nothing in, until it happens to them. And then they want the whole world to do something about it. But you know, what I mean that that shit was that shit was actually it was it was I mean I had to watch it like at least about five ten times. I mean she was trying to, and then I mean it was like he it was crazy like that can happen to anybody. You understand what I'm saying? But I mean they targeting they targeting black females. But you know what I'm saying like he uh he grabbed her and tried to hammer her up. Man I don't even know what fast food it was I think it was Burger King or something. But see it should be a little GoFundMe page uh, GoFundMe page for her or something. Shit, I mean, she lost her job off of the, off of somebody trying to physically harass them in the workplace. Like that's crazy to me. You know what I'm saying? Then in Houston, in Houston right now, I don't even know if they've even uh, caught this person, but it was a a white dude who um, got into like a road rage incident with a with a, a black lady, and her daughter was in the car, and um, dude drove up on her and shot in her car. Matter of fact, I think she had like two, three other kids in the car. He shoots up the car, hits the little girl, and she dies. Now they're saying they want a manhunt for this dude, but I mean they they supposedly have pictures. They supposedly have pictures of <clears throat> this truck that the guy was driving in Houston. Um see my thing is man, where where all the where all the hardcore killers at? In Houston, where all the real niggas, quote unquote, at in Houston. That's the thing that gets me, man, is that a lot of like if you were to do this in certain areas and certain cultures, if you were to roll up in their neighborhood and cause any type of anything, you shoot somebody, you kill somebody, man, that neighborhood's gonna come and look for you. You ain't gotta worry about the police. You ain't gotta worry about the police. You gotta worry about the neighborhood coming to get you. And that's what that's that's what that's what that's 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 the bullshit, man. Black people don't don't we don't we ain't doing what we used to do. You know what I'm saying? Like it should not only be a manhunt, but somebody should be getting on TV from law enforcement saying, "Please don't do any type of vigilante anything." But you don't get that. You don't hear that at all. Cause it's not enough hardcore quote unquote niggas. That are doing anything about it right now. It should be a manhunt from every single gang nigga, every single uh whatever, man. It should be every single dude that's hardcore. I don't see it's this thing, man. You know, you got you got people that that are killers. Oh shit, I don't know, that's a bee. I don't fuck around with the bees around here, man. These bees be extra aggressive. But um <clears throat> you got a lot of hardcoreness that people be yapping and talking about, and you know these Negroes will even be even dumb enough to even put shit on camera, not thinking that they, they you know that you getting watched, you getting watched, man. But still, at the same time, though, all these people that claim to be whatever, why ain't they looking for this dude? Why ain't they looking for this dude? Man? <clears throat> Appreciate everybody, man. I mean, check the nigga out. Uh, yeah, man. Like, why isn't there? It should be like manhunt from law enforcement and manhunt from, you know, the city of Houston. I should say. Because these white supremacist dudes, man. I'm telling you, man. Y'all gotta watch. Y'all gotta watch out for these groups, man. 
these dudes are going to keep turning up. They gonna keep turning up, yo. You gotta watch for these dudes, man. When it's when it, when people be saying it's th- it's getting real out here, it's getting real out here, man. It's getting really real out here. You know, what I mean, you got these groups out here that are that are causing damage and they're not being, you know, called domestic terrorists at all, but they're cause they're causing harm and they're causing death to you know majority black people and they targeting black people. You know what I'm saying? They're targeting these these black women. You know what I mean? They're targeting the kids. You know, and the black males, you know, they 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 just gonna try to kill us. You know what I mean? It's it's a it's a it's a you know, some people say it's a silent war going on right now. But my thing is that, you know what I mean, you got way too many Negroes calling the Matrix. You know, they they, they you know, too many Negroes turning up out here and not uh Focusing on shit. Appreciate everybody t- checking with your boy. Uh, let's see, man. I'm trying to think, man. Um, I seen some of that Floyd Mayweather fight. I mean, you know, I heard he got like nine million dollars for that fight, but I mean, what the what the fuck was that fight, man? What was like? Did anybody even did they even have it on pay per view? I mean, it, what did he fight? He fought over in what Japan or China or something. Like, damn, they ain't got no. I mean, was that even a fight? I mean, it was more like a, a spectacle, man. I mean, damn, Floyd Mayweather, man, it was like for nine mil. That's that's what you gonna do for nine million dollars, my nigga. Like, you used to taking fights, getting like a hundred and ninety million. Like, hey, what is this? Like, what is this? What was I? I mean, I, I, I just saw highlights, and I'm just like, what is this? What, what kind of highlights am I watching here? It's bullshit, man. It's like they, it's like they, uh, you know, they got Floyd fighting, you know, he gonna be fighting animals here in a minute. Watch what I tell you. And they gonna fight a little, uh, alley cat or some shit. They gonna fight a butt fucking, uh, clawless, uh, animal. Where they can throw punches or a kangaroo. So watch what I tell you, man. Come on, man. This dude, man. Floyd Mayweather. I mean, he's losing respect, man, with all these fights he's taking, man. Like, nigga, just bow out the game gracefully, man. Just be glad they ain't taking your money yet, dude. You know what I'm saying? Uh, also, uh, the Colts, Indianapolis Colts. Watch what I tell you. Watch what I tell you. Them coaches is about to get it popping. Watch what I tell you. They gonna go to Houston and they gonna beat Houston. Then they gonna go. I think they gonna go to Kansas City and they gonna beat Kansas City. And then man, hopefully man, if if New England is there, then New England is there. But fuck it, I think they gonna beat New England too. Now some of y'all, you know, may get turned off from that. And be like nigga, coach ain't going to the Super Bowl. Watch what I tell you. Watch what I tell you. They're number six C right now. You know what I mean? And you gotta be careful when you see, you know, these lower seeds. There's been a lot of there's been a lot of six seeds that have went to the Super Bowl. Uh, I can't think of none right now. <laughs> but I know there's been some. I know there's been some because I watched the shit. You understand? So I mean, even if they make it to the AFC championship, that's gonna be big. You know what I mean? That's going to be real big. You understand what I'm saying? That's going to be real big. Oh, shit. Man, in 2019, man, just be careful what y'all do out here, man. Be careful what y'all got going on out here. Make sure y'all not slipping. You know what I mean? Don't be complacent. You know, you may have to keep your head on a swivel out here, yo. You know what I mean? But, hey, it's needed, man. Shit's, shit's popping real heavy out here. Uh, so, yeah, man. Hey, that's all I pretty much got, man. You know what I'm saying? Now, you know what I mean? Uh, going off that Benny. That Benny drill. So, the Benny's taking over right now. So, I'm about to just be out. Uh, hey, holla at your boy, man. Um, hit my hashtag up. W-T-F-P-R-O-B-L-E-M-B. That's what the F is your problem be. Uh, Comedian Jay Scott on all social media platforms. Hey, 
appreciate this, man. I trying to drop some shit here this upcoming year, so be on the lookout for me. Yeah, man, make sure to try to get out to the people. But I appreciate the love, man. I'm out, man. Peace. Uh-huh.